Yeah. What's going on, guys? It's Greg Farther from the Wise Guys, and I'm here with. My name's Ryan Gaskins. I played uh, Guru Control today. Normally, normally I play Dino, but Sky Striker's on balance. We need, I think he's a hit. You're the Dino dude. Man. I'm the Dino don't, guy. Don't play with my mo. Uh, you, you can't win. You can't <laughs> win against Striker. Okay. So uh, pretty pretty standard build. Uh, three Guru. Three Judgment. Three Ash. Mm. Uh, double ogre, all two's on. How'd you like over over the other hand? Uh, I was thinking about main and draw because it's really good. Mm -hmm. Um, but my striker matchup is absolute shit, so I need to hit the multi roll as fast as possible, and then also just uh, it's it's actually pretty good against uh, a lot of the road decks. So. Um, this was new. I ran two of these uh, just for more engine starters. Uh, however. I don't think it really made a difference today, so I'm probably going to drop back down to one. Right. Uh, and then the one Umbatrix card is insane. You get into a crazy loop where every turn you're banishing their monsters. Uh, best spell, Search Guru, and the get attacks, flip stuff. It's amazing. Uh, we like cards. Yes, we do. Uh, this, oh, this card's controversial. I, I hate this card. I hate this card so much. I see it in multiples, and it breaks my hands, but then... When you open up one of these in the extravagance, you just smile because you're like, I'm about to draw two cards. So. I hate it too, bro. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> double duality because we like to dig. Double terraforming to get us two R cards. This card is nuts. Absolutely insane. <laughs> My God, the salad. I, uh, this deck has inherently really easy salad matchup um, for a number of reasons. I'll get into it in a second, but this card is just insane. Uh, recycles your fiendus. Some some builds don't run this. I don't understand how. Like this is a grind deck, and this ensures that you will win the, win the grind deck. So you would rec highly recommend that card? Oh, highly, highly. A lot of people disagree. And it makes Guru um, a quick play. And against salads, it's great because if you just book him in the first monster, you're just nothing. It's game. It's game. Yeah, you ain't gonna be talking about salad players like I ain't sitting right here. At this time, if you are not in the top three strikes, the room is now closed. Strikes amazing. Please make your way towards and, uh, the end. Once again. If you start things are going heavy in the south combo, strike them when you get their summon, they commit all the resources to it, it's just game. Uh, and now the actual card that makes South players cry. There can be only one. Alright, I'm about to cut this video off. <laughs> <laughs> I played like five salads today. Um, I didn't drop a single match to anything. So, Unlike me, I played like zero minutes. Oh, it's, it's fantastic. <laughs> uh, this card's new, actually. Um, I just picked these up. Um, I took out my Veilers for them. I don't know how I like them. I don't think it's as good as I thought. Apparently, if you want to negate the column, you have to target their monster. I thought it was just a monster. It's just a... Yeah, it's, it's okay. Yeah. And then um, I cut this down from three to two, which kind of sucks. It's a great card to open. It has four effects. And it's just... It's, it's insane. It's insane. You prefer two over three? You used to play three? I used to play three. Wow. Uh, the, the reason being why, because if you open one of these in your hand, and you have uh, a way to get to Hidden City, you don't have, I mean, off your Guru Flip, you can add Umatrix, you can add um, a next turn play, you can, you can look to the future of the game, and not have to search this card. Uh, this is all trash. Uh, you run three of these just to make sure you don't bash up off the extravagance, so mm -hmm. you have a target. Um, I don't know what this even is. I think it's the Thunder Dragon. I don't know. <laughs> dark monsters, because dark monsters are good. Mud Dragon is cool. <laughs> you want a Mud Dragon, get some rogue decks. And then uh, his effect's actually relevant, because you can call Earth, and then your Sun Terrors won't get targeted or some shit. Uh, obviously, Thunder Dragon. I played. I did play a uh, Cyber Dragon today. I never got this off, though. It's kind of cool. And the one for the prank kids, and then. For whatever god reason you want to get rid of a fetus, I have no idea. But all right, so this card is amazing, but it's also not. It underperformed all day. I found myself not citing it in when I probably should be. Uh, I feel bad. I played a pendulum player today. Went to battle phase. He changed his continuous trap one. And he popped this on so Pond Resolution. I had zero cards. That was you? So he banished everything. <laughs> I heard about yeah, that. He banished his entire. He didn't keep, didn't keep anything on field. <laughs> so I felt terrible because he was. He was uh, I think he was in high school still. Yeah. So, but yeah, that's. Oh, yeah, it's insane. Uh, this card, shout out to my teammate uh, TJ. He recommended this for my striker matchup, and this card is insane. At first, I'm like, God, this card's whatever. But no, against striker, it's nuts. So each time a card special summoned, it's effects from the game. 
So they normal summon raid, you flip this, they try to go into their link, the gate. You attack it, it dies, Ray comes out, Ray can't quick play out. It's done. Even if next turn they do it, they go to something else, still negated. They get nothing. Striker needs to die. <laughs> Fuck Sky Striker. <laughs> Uh, Lancia, uh, so I, I, know, I know a ton of people aren't playing these, but like, against, um, the majority of the decks, this shit rarely hurts, actually. They won me my, th my Thunder Danger today. Uh, two Pinkatops, I'm like the last guy, the sub player player, or the Ultra Guys player. This card came fucking nuts. Um, when I had to go first against a back row deck, and then obviously, Droll and Lockbirds, um, the Striker matchup. Yeah, pretty good. Any shout outs? Uh, shout out to Spell Speed Forward Gaming. Great team, great guys. Shout out to all my teammates. Uh, thank you, TJ. You won me the fucking game with his usual turn. So, shout out to Dylan for hooking us up with cheap hotels so we can do enough to get up at 2 in the morning. But otherwise, yeah. Thank you, guys. Nice. Thank you, my brother.